Ram, what's the big response from the lads been like since Saturday? Yeah, it's been good. Um, we looked at the couple of bits and pieces from the game. Um, it was good because we had a long journey home, so we'd be able to show them some stuff on the coach as well. Uh, try and get ahead of the curve a little bit. So I know Cliff was was on that and and Kyle. Um, so it was good. It, you look, it's good to to have a game so quickly after after a disappointing result and performance. I felt um, on Saturday. Uh, there was areas in the game where I thought we were really good. Uh, but, but bits and pieces, particularly in the second half, when when we when we got one back, um, like I said, after the game, I felt we just went a little bit too direct, way too direct, and, and it was almost becoming hopeful. Um, so we've ironed a couple of issues out this morning. We're focused on the next game. Um, you know, when it's a busy week like this, we want to try and get on to the next one as quickly as possible. It's fairly simple things to to iron out, really. Yeah, I mean, it's it's. It's probably players just desperate. We're desperate, you know, to get that next goal, and sometimes that can work against you. And I felt it did on on Saturday. Um, so we just need to understand that we we continue to play to our principles, the way we want to set the team up, and how how we want to go forward. Good session this morning. Yeah, everyone's good. Everyone's fine. The training was sharp this morning, so we're looking forward to to, to another home game tomorrow evening. What are you expecting from Crawley? Obviously, made a fantastic start. Certainly, the form recently has been. Very yeah, good. I think they have. I think they've. Probably surprised a few people of, of how they've started, but um, prob- not me really, because I think I, I think they've got good players in their team and uh, they play in a certain way. They're very much a possession-based team, and um, they've got good good individuals and good footballers in the team. So uh, it's going to be another tough game. Is it indicative of how competitive this division is this season? Um, I think so. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, no game's easy. It's tough, tough games, and they're flying high at the top end of the league, and they'll be absolutely delighted with two points a game and twenty points. You know, it's promotion form the way they're the way they're playing. So um, we've got a lot of catching up to do. Um, I feel like we've we we have turned the corner in terms of definitely performances. And Saturday we took a step back, but now we need to we need to get back on that on that horse again. Be open to put a run a form together at home. Yeah, we hope so. I mean. Look, we've been the last few games. We've been okay and, and good at home. So um, we want to do that again. You know, it's important to uh, to, to be in and around that top seven or, or, or the top end of the league. You need to be strong at home uh, and pick up as many points as you can away from home. So we, we understand that. Fitness-wise, any new issues from the weekend? Yeah, there's a, there's one missing from Saturday. Like I said, after the game, there always seems to be um, knocks and nickels after after defeats, and it's just yeah, it's just the way it is. But um, we'll have one missing who started the game on Saturday, um, but we feel we're strong anyway in, in that area. So um, yeah, hopefully it doesn't it doesn't affect us. You up and running with your Prostate United challenge? Uh, you and the staff as well? Are you yeah, we are. Everyone's uh, everyone's loving it. Um, Getting the getting the work done and you know trying to get it out of the way in the mornings before we come into to our proper job. So um, yeah, it's enjoyable. It's 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 uh, the together is a very one as well, and you can see everyone's progress. So um, the support we've received has has been has been excellent. I'm going to say you're pleased with the support from supporters as well. But it's been, it's been really good. Yeah, the donations have been excellent. I think we're right up there near the top end of the the team that's that's uh, that's um, raised the most money, and we're only two days in. So. I think Blackburn at the top and we're second out of a lot of teams, 40 or 50 teams. So the more we can get, the more we can um, push up that table in, in terms of uh, raising a much much needed cash for this for this charity and, and awareness. 